Do you want to know what it's like to live in one of the most popular areas in western Henrico County? The answer is yes. Be sure to stay tuned. y'all, I'm Holly. If you want to know what it's like to work, live, and play in RVA, well, you've come to the right place. Be sure to subscribe and click on the bell so you'll receive notifications each time I upload a new video, which is about twice a week. I love helping people relocate to the area or answer questions about the area. Please give me a call or shoot me a text at 804-380-6041 or send me an email, whichever is most convenient. Today, we are out in Glen Allen, Virginia, which is part of Western Henrico County. Let's take a drive and see what all this area has to offer. First, we're gonna start right here at Echo Lake Park. Echo Lake Park has so much to offer. To begin with, there is a 12-acre lake in the center of the park. You will oftentimes see people fishing from the shore side or from the pier for bass and sunfish. Now, Echo Lake does have its own specific fishing regulations, so be sure to check those before you drop your line in the water. If you're looking for somewhere to take a leisurely stroll or maybe get some exercise, there's a three-quarter mile walking path around the lake. While you walk, you can enjoy the beautiful scenery as well as the wildlife. There is also a playground up ahead and a covered picnic area. Well, that concludes our time at Echo Lake Park for today. Now let's head out and take a look at some of the Glen Allen subdivisions. We are heading down Springfield Road. You will see a number of different subdivisions off to both your left and right, as well as some houses that sit directly on Springfield Road. Now our first stop is Spring Creek. Now this subdivision was developed around 1996, and I'd say these are some mid-sized homes for the area. The average price point is around $430,000. Now, as I mentioned earlier, this market in the Glen Allen area is one of the hottest markets in the Richmond Metro. So houses are going very quickly, as well as for top dollar, especially those that are in pristine condition. Now, this subdivision does have a yearly HOA, but that is true for a number of the subdivisions in this particular area. Be sure to stay tuned till the end for a look at the schools that this particular subdivision is currently zoned to attend. Now, if you are finding this video helpful and you're enjoying the content, please like the video. Also, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell so you'll receive notifications each time I post videos such as these. Now, let's sit back, relax, and enjoy the tour. going to head a little farther down Springfield Road and take a look at another subdivision just around the bend. Now this subdivision has two entrances. One is off of Springfield Road, the other is off of Staples Mill Road or Route 33. It's actually two different subdivisions that interconnect. One side is called Carrington, 
The other side is called the Meadows at Carrington. Now these homes are a little bit higher of a price point than the last subdivision that we toured. Average is about 470,000, but there are homes in the subdivision reaching up well into the 500,000s. This subdivision also has an HOA. So let's explore what this subdivision looks like, and then we'll head on out and take a look at the schools. are currently zoned to attend. Always remember, it's good to check to see what the current zoning is and I'll leave the link to the information below. Our first stop is Glen Allen High School home of the Jaguars. Now, Glen Allen High School is one of the newer high schools in Henrico County. In 2019, they were one of the schools that received the Board of Education's Distinguished Achievement Award. Our next stop is Hungry Creek Middle School, home of the Cougars. Hungry Creek is also one of the newer middle schools in Henrico County. Our last stop is Echo Lake Elementary School, home of the Dolphins. Now Echo Lake also won the Board of Education Excellence Award in 2019. Fire Station 15, otherwise known as the Glen Allen Fire Station, provides service to this area. It's located at the intersection of Mountain Road and Mill Road. Henrico Fire maintains a comprehensive all hazards capability. At Fire Station 15, you will find Engine 315 and Medic 315, as well as a tanker and a brush truck. In addition, Station 15 is the home of the mass casualty team for the county. See the tree in the picture with all the white blooms? That's called a Bartlett pear tree, and they're real popular here in Richmond. However, when a big strong wind comes through, they can topple over. I had one in my front yard, and we had a storm come through one night, and the thing toppled over and landed on two vehicles. It was a good thing it didn't do any damage, but it took us several hours the next morning to cut it up to get the vehicles out from underneath it. Well, the sun is setting over RVA, so let's leave Glen Allen and head on back through Innsbruck. Now Innsbruck holds 22,000 employees and over 500 employers. It sits on almost 600 acres of land. So lots of different options in terms of job possibilities. Definitely an area that you would want to explore if you are on the hunt for a new position. If you're thinking about 
about moving to the area or just have some questions, give me a call or shoot me a text at 804-380-6041 or you can send me an email, whichever is most convenient. Until next time, always remember, together we can, RBA.